So this is into CB circles question in the given figure AB, AB equal to AC and AC is equal to CD. AB, BC, CD, these three sides are equal. ADC, ADC, this angle. This angle is given to be 38 degrees. Calculate angle ABC, ABC. This is the question. This is the question. The second question is BEC, BEC. Basically, you have to join these two lines and you have to find BEC. Yes, Mr. C. How should I solve the question? Uh, so, in this question, we have been given the angle 30 degree uh, as angle ADC. So, therefore, angle CAD will also be 38 degree. Okay. What you are saying is because this side and this side is equal, therefore, therefore, triangle CAD is the isosceles triangle. This is isosceles triangle. Therefore, if this is 38 degree, this would also be 38 degree. Am I correct? Yes. Okay. So what next? So then we have been given two angles. So therefore, we can find the third angle, angle ACD. So therefore, angle ACD would be 76, uh, sorry, 104 degree. Uh, so this is 38 degree. This is 38 degree. So these two, basically what you were saying is that let us consider A, C, D. This triangle, am I correct? So in this triangle, we now have two angles, 38 and 38, which is equal to 76 degrees. So we are left with this angle which will be equal to 104 degree. Am I correct? Yes. yes. Okay. What next? So angle CAE, angle CAE is 38 degree. So yes. therefore angle CBE will also be 38 degree. So what you are saying is, if we consider this to be the chord, this to be the chord, this angle, and this angle, they would be the same. Is this what you are saying? Yes. So what you are saying is that in a circle, this is a chord. They go this angle and this angle. These two angles would be the same. Am I correct? Yes. yes. So once we have found this to be 38 degrees, then we can find this angle to be 38 degrees. Okay. What next? So. Angle ACB will be 76 degree because 180 minus 104 will be 76 degree. So ACB would be 76 degree. And because side AC and EB is equal, so therefore angle ACB will be equal to angle ABC will be equal to 76 degree. So what you are saying is that you had already found this angle, this angle to be 104 degree. Therefore, this angle would be 76 degree. Now, this triangle ACB, triangle, I'm sorry, triangle ABC is an isosceles triangle. So, this angle and whole of this angle would be equal to 76 degree. This is 38 degree. Therefore, this angle would also be 38 degree. Do we agree? Yes. And the whole angle ABC, the whole angle is equal to 70, 76 degrees. Okay. So we have done the first part. Okay. Now we are left with BEC. BEC. Okay. How do we find this? So now, uh, because we have, we can take triangle. Okay. So now, uh, what we can do is that because we have. Uh, so, Mr. CB, what we can do is this is a chord that you have, BC. Yes. This chord will make one angle here and another angle here. Do we agree? Yes. yes. So, what we can do is that 76 plus 76 would be around uh, uh, 
152 and 180 minus 152 would be 28 degrees. So angle BAC would be 28 degree and Sobel angle BEC. So this angle, this angle, this angle, this angle would be 28 degree. Am I correct? Yes. So this angle, this angle, this angle would be 28 degree. Am I correct? Yes. So BEC, BEC, this would be 28 degree. Mr. Zibang, any doubt? Yes. No, sir. So, basically, this is what we did. So, what we were given, what we were given was ADC. What we were given was ADC, 38 degrees. So using this to be 38 degree and the properties of isosceles, we were able to find this. Then we were able to find this. Then we were able to find this. Then using the property of chord, we were able to find this. Then using the property of isosceles angle, this was 76. We were able to find all of this angle. The whole of this angle will be 76 degree. Then Again, taking this to be the this to be the common chord, and using the properties of we had this angle, we had this angle, we were able to find this angle. So once we had found this, this was the common chord. This was one of the angles which was being formed, and this was another angle which was being formed. So we were able to find this angle. This is not any doubt. No, no, sir. Great, sir. 